Hey there everyone, in this video, um, well, continuing on our ASP introduction series, um, I'd like to introduce you to half-track mode. Um, many of you may not know that ASP can operate a half-track. Okay, what I mean by half-track is basically you've got your, um, you know, two motors powering the tracks at the back, and but steering is done with the front wheels using a steering servo. Okay, so the two motors will drive at uh, well, the same rate and steering is done with your servo at the front okay now to set ASP into half track mode what you need to do is you need to modify very easy modification of your servo of your receiver connection cable okay now ASP runs with your steering channel as channel 1 so RTE RTEA R for rudder steering um, T for throttle Okay, that's your second channel. So on your receiver connection cable, your steering channel is channel one, which is this white wire. Okay, so we don't want to be sending that information to ASP. We want to be sending that information to our servo instead. Okay, so what you need to do is you need to get a, a, a hobby knife and just gently lift up that tab there and pull out the, yellow, the, the white wire. Similarly, you need to then take channel 2, your yellow wire, and do the same. Just lift that tab up, pull that, this little one pin connector off. Then you just swap the wires around. Okay, and here's one I prepared earlier. Okay, you put the yellow wire into where the white wire was, and then your yellow, your sorry, your white wire is now free. Okay? Now you connect up to your receiver like this. Okay, you get your steering servo and you connect that into channel one. Okay, so you've got your servo goes into channel one. Your three pin connection here now with your yellow wire goes into channel number two. And the other channels are as follows. Okay, so you have your steering servo in channel one. Okay, you, what was your steering channel, your white wire is now free. You don't connect that up anywhere. Okay, now it's a simple matter of connecting to ASP. When ASP notices that there's no information coming down on channel 1, it will automatically switch into half-track mode. Okay, so we've got that there. We'll place our steering servo here so you can see it. We'll just use a, that to hold it in position. Okay, now let's power up. I've got I've got ASP running in um, airsoft mode, uh, so it starts up really quick. And also, I've still got the T thirty four sound set on here. And as you heard, the Russian voice. Hopefully, Mikhail or Alexi, if you're listening, um, if you guys could record us some much better, authentic Russian voices, that would be cool. Okay, so ASP is ready to go. Let's uh, let's turn it on. Okay, I've also got a um, a smoke unit connected up as well, so um, so you can hear when that turns on. Okay, ASP should now be running in half track mode. So as you go forward, as, as actually I won't go forward just yet. I'll just steer. So as you can see there, I'm moving my um, left to right, and you'll see the servo is operating the steering to go forward. Okay, you'll see the motors are running. And there we have our steering. Okay, um, that motor sounds a bit loud, but anyway, I think you, you get the, uh, the drift there. Um, there will be a particular setting on the 9XR. I'll just turn that smoke unit off. Okay, there will be a edited uh, setup on the 9XR to give you a bit better, well, to really optimize the control for a half track. Um, this is obviously optimized to control a tank. Um, there will be a, a different set of settings on your 9XR or on your, any Turnigy 
um, or program any radio, I guess, to suit uh, half-track mode. So there we go, um, half-track mode working with uh, ASP. Thank you. <laughs>